Then we have um, a fan favorite for the time. This is like I, I don't remember his name in this game, but it's like <laughs> like SR three. So I don't even know. But um, he's basically what he's basically a um, um, early version of Orbot. And um, he's great. He's great in this game specifically for how he basically like. Let me see her. He, he's um, basically calling Eggman out on being <laughs> being an idiot, basically. Um, and I that, that's amazing. Um, Cause I feel I feel Eggman works the best when he he's able to. Um, uh, what is it? When he's able to uh, bounce off of like his robot companions, um, like that's. I feel like that that's where he's usually at his best, uh, in terms of just being um, comedic and entertaining. Um, obviously, when you're trying to be a, when you're trying to be more serious with Eggman, I feel like at that point it's better to um, make like the the robot uh, the companions or whatever the hell you want to call them um a bit more sorry i'm trying i'm trying to, i'm just trying to uh listen to cutscene right now um but i feel like when you're trying to make eggman a bit more serious um i feel like at that point it's better to um not have the robot companions talk or be in the cutscene um but stuff like this I enjoy, where it's just it's just Eggman trying to go over his plans and whatnot, and this and this uh, the, this dude is just kind of basically it's basically just saying, dude, you caused all these problems. You're dumb. Like, <laughs> why? Like you could have handled things a lot better to ensure that you um that you win, but you you don't. So it's like, bruh. <laughs> Uh, the, the the dynamic I think is the is the best is the uh, most important thing. Like the Eggman's dynamic with his robots is um is what makes makes it click, I guess. Um, because yeah, that's some great stuff. And I feel like it's just gonna go to. It's gonna go to um the hub, right? And say, oh we got a new we can go to a new area now. Like brah. Yeah, oh, okay, we can Well hi Brenda. Um I wonder if I can go back. Yeah, let's just go back. Let's just I might as well just um clear out all the stuff um that we can. I like see if we can go do the act two stage, because I remember I remember act two being fairly Fairly uh, interesting, actually. Um, but if not, we'll just talk to a few NPCs, and uh, that'll be it for this version, I guess, for now. Okay, yeah, we can we can do it. Okay, cool. Unless the boss is you ever feel like replaying it for whatever reason. Yeah, there's usually like two night stages and like three day stages. Sometimes four, but not often I think. I could be wrong. It kind of varies. I am, I am, um, I do enjoy doing all the, all the extra stuff because in playthroughs most people seem to skip out on this. Um, like they kind of just do the regular game and leave it at that. Um, Whereas I'm doing basically everything I can, I can find, um, and yeah, it's well, it's definitely a lot. Like this is definitely gonna be a long play for us. I keep mentioning like, oh god, this <laughs> uh, like even when we finish the story, we still gotta do all the DLC, um, and uh, oh <laughs> yeah, um, that's gonna take a while in, in and of itself. So yeah, this game this game's gonna take a while, which uh, ergo is more, even more of a reason for me to record this more frequently, but I just don't because <laughs> uh, I, I need to get into, into the habit of like recording this more often. 
Because not of, it's one of those cases where it's not necessarily because I don't I don't want to play this game. Like I I if I would it's one of those things where like um I could like I can just I can play this game on my own start to finish no problem by myself. But when it comes to like actually record like doing the commentary and all that I can't sometimes I'm just like I really just can't be bothered like I at that point I'm just like I'd rather just stream something as, instead because it's much easier and I, I don't have to worry too much about the commentary and I can just you know, relax um, whereas when I when I do um, like an LP I have to worry about like am I being Cons like, not consistent, but am I being entertaining enough with uh, my commentary? Um, am I like making sense? Um, do am I dwelling on one thing for too long and stuff like that? Um, yeah, this is fairly difficult. Um, yeah, so one of those things where like. I, I, okay, I feel like the best way to say it is that um, playing a game and recording a game are two completely different things. Um, like, well, recording commentary for it more specifically, because uh, recording a game, like, yeah, you have to make sure your gameplay's decent, or, uh, or like, entertaining to watch. Um, obviously, you can get around that by editing, but you want to make sure that like, you're you you don't want to you don't want to make a playthrough that's like boring to watch essentially, um, and there's definitely a lot. It's definitely difficult when you're doing it live uh, specifically. Right, let me just. Yeah, this is really difficult. <laughs> actually, no. I feel like it's a, I, I, then I feel like there's an easier way to do this actually. Uh, so let's just deal with these guys again. out the frame rate a little bit more. Coolio. Okay. So an easier way to do this is like let like, drop, drop it down there. No? I feel like you should be able to do it like this. There we go. Okay, yeah, th this is much easier. I don't know if this is what they intended, but hey, it works. Oh god. Uh, uh. <laughs> that <laughs> is a problem. Please say it respawned. Yeah, okay, good. Yeah, this is fairly tricky. Take it easy. I'm not getting I'm not getting an ass like I can tell you that much. But whatever works. Don't fall off. Yeah, I I'm pretty sure they expect you to do um jump um jump with the uh, thing, but screw that. Yeah, can you like grab that please? Is that good enough? There we go. Okay, cool. Ooh. Yeah, this isn't playing around, that's for sure. Yeah, I feel like this is one of the more interesting instances of uh, using the these uh, gem key things. Because uh, I remember saying in the past, like, I wish the, this version just used the ones from the Wii version. Um, and I do still stand by that for the most part, but this is the one instance where I feel like it's justified. Like this, 
wouldn't have worked with the Wii versions like keys key system so I, I gotta give them props for this like this is a creative use of this uh, mechanic and it works fairly well I feel like it's a bit it's a bit too um, unforgiving like trying to get from like trying to jump on all these platforms earlier but I do like the idea uh, they're going with this with the with this. Yeah, this is a this is a pretty cool stage. Maybe they could have again. Maybe they could have toned it down in terms of difficulty just a little bit, but eh, I, it's fine. It's not the end of the world, especially since um, like this is like I said in the uh, regular tune on stage. I said that the regular level was a bit too basic and kind of a bit too easy, just in general. Um, this is, it definitely remedies that problem quite a fair bit. Um, this is definitely a lot more interesting, there's more platforming involved, there's more danger of dying in general. Um, again, I like the use of these keys, it's one of the more interesting uses of it in the game, and it's very deadly. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'd, I'd say this is a fairly Pretty, pretty great level overall, I'd say. Just, yeah, it's pretty good. I feel, yeah, I, I feel like instead of making it, making the level easier itself, I feel like the one thing you could do to uh, make it less terrifying, like jumping from those platforms with the keep, uh, thing, wherever the hell they are, <laughs> um, wherever the hell they are, um, well, you could just make the warehouse jump a bit go a bit further and that that's it like that's all you really need to do and that'll be fine but other than that though i really do like this stage this is this is pretty good stuff overall and it uh reward reward you depending on who you ask i guess with a a combat sequence when you get past like one of those uh sections where you have to put the keys in keys in so uh yeah i feel I feel like if this was on the Wii, this would have just been like the Act 2 or... Well, this is the Act 2, but what, what I mean is like, this would probably be like... Um, have it so... The, the first stage we did was like, that, that's the normal Act 1, and then this is the is the mandatory Act 2, is what I mean. Like, this is mandatory before you fight the Dark Guy Phoenix. Um, so it's, it's kind of interesting in that way, I guess. Because I, I do feel like... When this gate, when this, um, I feel, okay, I feel like the regular stages, the re re regular Werehog stages overall, um, the platforming and the fighting is more balanced overall than the HD one, but when it comes to like the extra stages, I, in my opinion, the platforming segments absolutely take a steaming dump on the Wii version, just in terms of quality. And um, overall, like challenge and all that stuff. Um, I, I, I feel, I, I feel like the extra stages and the DLC stages, for that matter, like do things with the, with the Werehog that's just way more interesting than anything the Wii version does. Um, but I will, I will concede that the Wii version does it, does the balance better in the regular stages that you need to play um so i it is a give and take give and take i guess um but that, that being said though i i do feel i like what is it um i do feel like um the combat with the werehog is is enjoy is um really enjoyable in this version um so the more f the fact that you have to do a lot more fighting i don't mind too much but yeah, it, it's definitely balanced a lot better in the way. Um, at least, again, at least on the regular stages. Um, so it's it's kind of interesting. And these uh, bee or hornet enemies are the bane of everyone's existence. Damn it! Also, the sound effects are like completely off when it does that. <laughs> Mm. 
fucking hell. These bees are like the worst. Especially when you just fail every time. Get slam. I feel like... Yeah, I just grab him. Oh, that was a complete accident. <laughs> Is it always circle? It can't be, right? No, okay. <laughs> that, so that, I, I just got in incredibly lucky there. Alright, fair enough. There we go. It's very hard to do that with the bees. Because they like to jump around and, and evade you a lot. There's like all these keys here. Like, what's going on? Is this the right one? Yep. And just... Pull this. How many medals are there? Okay, we, we're missing two. What do I need this for? Is there like the key somewhere in there or some or whatever? Let's destroy all these jars because. We hate it. <laughs> we hate the stuff, I guess. Duh. Okay, I guess it's for that over there. Wait, did we just do a complete, like, U-turn? Or, like, did we just, um, go around in the circle? Oh, okay, yeah, th this is the end. Okay, yeah. Okay, make sure there's nothing here. Okay, we're still missing like... Yeah, we're still missing two medals. I don't know where they are exactly. That's yeah, fine. Cool. I didn't need to do the finisher, I wanted to grab him, but whatever, it's fine. Yeah, throwing enemies, I feel like it doesn't do as much damage in this version. I could be wrong. Grab you, do that. There we go. Hopefully that uh, gives me an S rank. Oops. Pressing wrong buttons. Yeah, good. Alright, kill you and then all this good with the world. Alright, is that gonna clear out or is that like just gonna stay there? Yeah, you got me. I have no idea where the uh, other medals are. Or whatever. Whatever. Nice. Good stuff. Now I can level up the speed. And give it some com more combat. Alright. And with that, that should be uh, Chunan cleared out for now.
So, uh, yeah, let's just go back to the hub and uh, see what's going on there. And then we'll end up end this session off with uh, just seeing what extra stuff is, there is to do on the way. And then we'll call it, call it there. Because, oh boy, like when you have to do both versions, um, it takes a while to do... Uh, one area. <laughs> kind of underestimated how long this would take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just get to- let's just get to the questions. Sure, let's do it. <laughs> Dr. Milkman. Or Do Dr. Milkman. Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I, I, I love these uh, other, like, answers they put in. Super Sonic the Hedgehog. Force Emeralds. Dark Guy Chicken Yeet! Yeah, I like that stuff. It, uh, stuff like that, it just... It's like, I, have you been paying attention? <laughs> and, uh, or, or, and also just... General stuff, like... If you know anything about Sonic, you should know these things. So I wonder... Uh, before we switch to the Wii, I, you've got to check out... Talk to all the townsfolk and see if there's... Anyone that needs to be uh, exercised, or um, there's other stuff going on. Okay. I'm not sure. We can do it. <laughs> yeah, it seems like most people are fine. I'm not seeing it. I'm not really seeing those uh, sperm things anywhere. <laughs> God, the <laughs> things are so weird. I know there has to be like one at least. It's yeah, just break tables, it's fine. <laughs> okay. Wait, like, you? Rip. So you're fine. We can buy stuff now. Let's buy all the all the stuff for the professor. Okay, I believe um, this is one I one of those uh, items where like if you buy enough and you like eat enough of them, you get a special CG cutscene with uh, Sonic and Chip doing a thing. Um, that's uh, all work well and good. Let's buy some apples. Yeah, we have a lot of rings now just for the fact that I did some of the hot dog missions. I'm not going to do all of them, but I did some of them. And just for the hell of it, let's buy a bunch of chili dogs. Fifty is fine. Okay, so I don't really know how this works. Wait, is there... I guess there's like just no one here. Like, there's no one that I know for. F Actually, I don't know if you ever have to do the uh, exorcism challenge in this in this hub. I could be wrong, but I don't remember it being here. But, yeah, either way. Um, so I guess I'll just have Sonic eat five, Sonic eat five and Chip eat five. I, yeah, I don't know how the game determines you unlocking the cutscene.
<laughs> well, there's, uh, what is it? How many? It's funny you brought that up because I was just talking about that. <laughs> um, yeah, the I've, um, you just ate, ate one earlier, chip. <laughs> um, like how he keeps saying that, like he never had it before, even though he's just, he keeps eating it. Am I imagining things? Yeah, I do like this little like flavor text you get from Chirp just making him eat food. But yeah, what's it? Um, there's uh, Deco and Boko from Sonic X. There's Scratching Ground, which is probably just the, the, those two are probably just the best ones, honestly. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, I think that's how- I think we just unlocked the, um, cutscene. I guess we'll have to find out. But we- oh man, I forgot- yeah, we haven't even eaten a lot of this stuff. Okay, let's give it to Chip once. <laughs> okay, he does. Okay, does he say something different for this? Okay, he does say something different for each of these. So I guess it is in my best interest to do that, even if I am sacrificing 70 XP. <laughs> nice. I don't- uh, Chip, Chip's a great character, I don't care what people say. <laughs> oh man. Okay, uh, let's give Chip a few. I mean, for like, Holoska, like... It, it'll be... Good to have a lot, like, have a, a lot of fur. Okay, I'm just gonna speed this up because I'm just gonna feed, be feeding Sonic a bunch of chili dogs. Okay, and now we're done with that. So, uh, you're all, all cleared out here. So, now we can go to the status again. Okay, that's not as much as I was expecting, but still, it's decent. Uh, let, let, let's just, mm, you know, let, let's upgrade bring, bring an issue, why not? And do some more combat. Okay, combo and then put shield. Ah, uh, barely not enough. <laughs> that kind of sucks. That's fine. Yay, Chip is happy. Woo! Yeah, that's uh, all for this. Um, I am gonna go to the um, the lab and see if the if we got a cutscene. Because if that's the case, I'll show that off before switching to the Wii for the last time this session. Because um, those CG cutscenes are pretty good. <laughs> Just having some good. Um, Interaction between Sonic and Chirp. Right, so I'm just gonna speed through this. And um, yeah, Amy, Amy has like something different to say like every time, so. Oh man. Alright, let's see. I should have the um, TV or whatever, right?
Uh, well, first off, let's give you the uh, souvenirs. Why not? No idea what you're talking about, but okay. <laughs> Oh, I won't do it. No, I don't need. To, I don't need this. Okay. So, do I not have the TV? Guess not. Okay. Well, let's uh, go. Let's go buy buy the uh, stuff then. Because I do want to show this off. <laughs> it's uh pretty. It's pretty funny. Excuse me. Oh, jeez. So go, let's go to the shop real quick. Yeah. Hey TV, here we go. TV, TV, TV. Sports, 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 sports. Call of Duty, Call of Duty, Call of Duty, Call of Duty. Etc, etc. And now we're at the point where we're running low on rings again, because because I bought so many chili dogs. Okay. That's five. Fair. <laughs> I did that on purpose to get more height. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Yeah. Okay, so now we can go to this. Uh, where is it? Oh, here we go. Yeah, th this is one or one of three special cutscenes you can get. Oh, I just love it. <laughs> like, the dynamics you get with Sonic and Chip in, in this game is great. Anyways, um... Yeah, that's just, that's pretty much it. I'm trying to stop as fast as I can. That weird circle was kind of weird. Yeah, you can't do it nearly as fast as in colors. In colors, you can just mash the cr mash the bone like crazy and go like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Can't exactly do that in uh, this game or gens. But yeah, um, that said, uh, that's it for the HD one, HD version for now. So uh, let's do a little bit of clean up on the Wii, and then we'll be done for today. Um, so yeah. Oh wait, uh, what the hell? Um, why am I missing a moon medal? What? What? 
Excuse me? I was about to say, like, um, I was just about to switch, but uh, I don't have the pedal. What the hell is it? What? Okay. Well, that explains that. Also, this can happen. Um, cause this is a weird thing. Uh, cause like, um, is it like the world itself still kind of is still still kind of like happening, I guess. Whereas Sonic is the only one that just um, pauses. So w when you do that on the rail, you get great stuff like this. We just we just kind of go nowhere. Um, but yeah, now that we got the medal, now I can just uh, exit and um, I will use this uh, transition to go back to the Wii. So um, yeah, and finally back in the Wii. So I'm just tell us, oh, go back to the Professor. Wow, all that good stuff. Um, so. Yeah, I know that the, yes, that we go to the professor and say, oh, you can go to uh, Chunan and Spagonia. Um, so I, I, I guess we, okay, I guess, I guess I may as well just do that, because I did do that on the HD one. And then after that, I'll just go through the Gaia gates, um, see if there's anything new. And that'll be it. Uh, sure, uh, uh, uh mm, I, may, I may as well, let's just get this out of the way. I'm not doing that. I'm not going to the shrine. <laughs> okay, now I. Okay, let, let, let's just see. So, uh, Chunan and Spagonia both are saying no because they both have to go to the day stages. But, are there any night stages left? There's one. Okay, let's just do that real quick. Um, it doesn't sound ex as exciting as still HD extra stage, but it's, it's something, I guess. Actually, no, this is Begonia, so uh, it's... Wait, so if I do this... No, immediate... Yeah, okay. <laughs> this should be really easy, then, because I can just walk it. Yeah, and this is Begonia, not Chunan, so maybe the Chunan one will be more interesting, we'll see. This is fairly pathetic, though. I I don't, I don't even really need to try to beat this. Like, there's a secret there. That's cool. Although, do I end up have to? Okay, so I can't just walk it, right? No. Okay. Go. Okay, fair enough. It, there is a bit of challenge to this. I can't just walk. <laughs> that would have been funny as hell if I could do that. Alright. Round... Technically three, but the first one didn't count, so... Round two. <laughs> Fight me. As long as I just... Bear my distance... I should be fine. Oh, let's get this again. Not really sure what that is, what it is, but hey, okay. item can't go wrong with getting an item. Okay, that was still pretty easy, but it's a it was a bit more challenging than I may than I expected, just a little bit, but still. And Chunan, do you have anything interesting? 
Nope, there's no new stages to speak of. So, um... Yeah, let's just scroll through all the areas again. Actually, you know what? The, the easier, there's an easier way to do this. I can... what's it? Go through these. Okay, so I'm missing exactly one from Apatos. Apatos. A bunch from uh, Haloska. Um, what was it? Yeah, Root Up Run, we... Uh, two Warhawk stages. Two... okay, okay. Cool. I see. Alright, so, um, yeah, as as usual, I'll just be going through all the uh, Gaia Gates, and uh, I will cut um, when, when I find a uh, unlockable door, and if I don't, then that's the end of the session, so, uh, yeah. <laughs>